This is Bruce Jansen at the 36th Annual SDEF Hawaii Dermatology Seminar. I'm speaking with Dr. Julie Harper of the University of Alabama. Dr. Harper, what's new in the treatment of ocular rosacea? There's been an interesting study published that looked at using cyclosporin emulsion drops to treat ocular rosacea. And I think that gives us something really valuable, valuable information. Many of us see patients who have rosacea along with ocular rosacea, and we don't always have treatment that's very effective. So it's nice to broaden our armamentarium, add something else to the list of potential treatments. And uh, in this study, uh, did it show significant efficacy? It did. There was statistical significance in all of the parameters that were looked at, and the parameters included Schirmer testing, which is really an evaluation of how dry the eye is, tear breakup time, corneal staining, and then probably most importantly from a rosacea standpoint, an ocular uh, disease severity index. And that was a questionnaire that the patients filled out. And over the 16 weeks of the study, that number really improved. So there was a great improvement in quality of life for individuals who had signs and symptoms of ocular rosacea. So this is another arrow in the quiver. What is your, uh, what's your go-to therapy? Well, I would still say that, you know, I do what I've done for years first, and that is oral doxycycline. That's my go-to treatment for mild to moderate and moderate to severe rosacea, and also for ocular rosacea, keeping in mind that the product is not specifically FDA approved for that. Uh, but I do use that as first line. But this, this has given me, given me another uh, arrow in the quiver, so to speak. It gives me another alternative.